My name is Owen Shipsad. I'm a graduate student from Johns Hopkins. Number eight. Number eight. <laughs> Head coach, Max Schlegel. Uh, Jake Pearson, senior, number four. Kyle Pearson, freshman, uh, number one. Alright coach, just, uh, just await thoughts on the game. Ah, just super excitement right now. I mean, it, it's hard to take yourself zoom out, but what I told them after the game is, we went up, we let them come back, and we showed the grit and the determination to not let us stop us. We went up by two goals, had a clock mail function, got the goal taken away, still played through it and got the stop at the end. I mean, there, there's not much better in, you know, playing for a championship, albeit third place, than, than having those moments where you know, your back's against the ropes and you play through it and you play for your teammates and, and come out with the win. I mean, super excited for, for all these guys and for the future. All in all, I'll start with you. Uh, you're, the, you're the old guy on the team, the, the grad student. You know, you guys are really young. What does that kind of made a boss maybe on the future of, of having such a young team and kind of having your backs against the wall there late to kind of pull that out and hold on to that win? Yeah, I think it's an awesome learning experience. I mean, this whole season we've grown so much because we are such a young team. And to see the progression of, of who we were that first tournament, you know, first weekend of September, and so now here we are in December, months later, uh, I think we're just two completely different teams. And, and people are stepping up from all over the place, showing real signs of, of grit, of competitiveness, of leadership. And it's really exciting. It, it makes me happy to know that uh, I'm leaving a program finally after so many years. <laughs> that I, I trust and that um, has so much signs of, of success moving forward. All right, Jake or Olin, you guys can take this since you guys are both done. What's it like to, to go out with a win in your career? Not everybody gets to win their last game of their career. What's it like to, to get that win, get oh, you know, third place to, to win that last game? Uh, that's true. It's really nice. And it, more than just a win, I think it was a game where um, you know, like had all the, the positives of water polo, like especially the teamwork and, and working as a team, uh, winning as a team. Uh, and really keeping our, our composure. It's a, it's a memory that I'm, I'm, I'll have forever, so. Yeah, ditto. I think uh, <laughs> obviously better to come out with a win than, than otherwise, but most importantly, we, we came out, we did the best we could given the circumstances, and we were able to take home some hardware for it. I, I would say these guys know both emotions because the first one, we, you know, it was kind of laying out the same way where we beat MIT to get here in the higher seed, 1D3. And to go home on that loss, knowing what we could have done, this is a way better feeling for sure. <laughs> Kyle, you had some fantastic saves today. You had that five meter stop early. Do you feel like that kind of set the tone yeah. for the game? For sure, for sure. Uh, you know, a good block always helps you perform better at the beginning. I mean, it just gets me going. Um, it gets everyone else going, too. How about uh, the defense in front of you? I felt like you guys had a million blocks today. Yeah. Uh, guys just getting their hands on balls. And, mm -hmm. you know, does that that kind of help you a little bit when your defense in front of you is just, is doing just such a great job? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, it's it's all about the mentality. Uh, when my players are shot blocking well, uh, I just I feel great and I feel like you can get all those shots just blocked. And, you know, I have really good defense. So Kyle, what was it like playing together with your brother this year? So awesome. It's really nice. It so yeah, much. it is fun. We, we end up... Uh, talking one-on-one -on -one a lot about <laughs> like everything in, in practices and games, but it's really nice just having all of my brothers on the team and then my actual brother as well. <laughs> so just some last thoughts, you know, we talked yesterday about, again, and we talked about today, such a young team to come along the way they did this season and just looking forward to next year and the, you know, the experience from this year and what it's going to do moving forward. Oh, I think it's everything. Um, like we talked about yesterday with having guys come in not knowing some of the basics of water polo, even though they're great athletes, they know the general sport, but getting into the details, I, I would say we didn't actually run Hopkins water polo until maybe three quarters of the season, and now we peaked here, and now we, we're not going to return six guys with college experience. We're going to return 16 guys with college experience, which is mind-blowing to me as Hopkins coming from a team of 11 and 13 at times. To, to return that number and, and have them know the system, how, have them know what I want out of them and the, and the pressure that it takes to be here and win. Um, you know, we're gonna, be, we're gonna be real tough next year with all that returning. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks. All right.